great to be here. Thanks for the invitation for Catherine and I to come down and, and join the proceedings. It's been good to catch up with uh, comrades and friends from across the years. We saw a ran free there a few minutes ago about uh, life back on the streets back in the back in the seventies, back in the Joe days, back in the days of the uh, the special ranch, etc. So, and we seem to have come full circle with uh, Campbell Newman and his crew up there. But it's it's good to be here. One of our most important cultural protocols in our Aboriginal community and culture is the, uh, the fact that we're, when we have events like this and gatherings like this, you pay homage and respect to the traditional owners and keepers of the country on which you gathered. My mob come from up north, it's where my grandmother, the Mullinjali mob, down around the voters at the border ranges and through grandfather up in central Queensland there. So I'm a, I'm a visitor here too. I was born and raised by people like Uncle Eddie Marbo and Uncle Don Brady and others and right back in the 60s and 70s when we were doing the serious business to build the, the black political movement. I noticed that every time we came onto a, a community or a different place that uh, we'd pause and those old people, the old men and the old women would uh, pay that respect, pay that homage. And uh, in keeping with that tradition we acknowledge the, the elders and senior people of the country from here uh, because it's our people through their culture, through the cultural practices, through their ceremonies, through the songs, through the stories, through the dances that maintains the cultural and spiritual integrity of country. And we, we respect that and we give a solemn undertaking to respect the people, the law and the land. We give a solemn undertaking to, to not cause any detriment to the country on which we gather and we give a solemn undertaking to honour the, the legacies and the gifts, many gifts from generations past and particularly here in Sydney which has been one of the, the most important places in the building of our struggle because it was here in the Australia Hall in Elizabeth Street back on uh, January 26, 1938 that the first National Day of Practice was held. We honour the, the great leaders, the great men and women who took part in that, in that practice and we honour all the mob from down here and it's a pleasure to be here. Thank you.